Lone Star 92.5, getting the proverbial let out. 722 on the Bowen Jim show. It's going to be windy today. Windy day today. Uh, sustained winds at 25 to 40 miles an hour. Gusts up to 50 miles an hour later on in San So in other words, if, if, if Zilch, the Tory Stiller, were to wear that little... Uh, that Renaissance hat, yeah, yeah, it would blow away. Yeah, you know, we can't. Do it. We have to tie down the ladies in hoop skirts. Oh, yeah. Nah, I can't. Nah. The last time we had winds, I tried to talk one of them into letting me tie a rope to her ankle and fly her like a cow. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> well, you know, we, you working out every year at the Scarborough Renaissance Festival, mm -hmm. which uh, runs through the 25th of May. It That's does right. indeed. Yes, That's right. We are, we are early this time. We have seven weekends left. Oh, right. seven whole weekends. Look out! In a three-day weekend on Memorial Day weekend. So, oh. mm. there's more Scarborough mm. than you can eat at yeah. this point. <laughs> That's right. I do it's like the turkey leg. Oh yeah, the little chickens on a stick. Huge. Too. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. And and the kids love it too, they don't do. they? Yeah. The Absolutely. Kids. There's lots of stuff for the kids. There's lots of rides. Mm -hmm. uh, you can ride an elephant and a camel. Mm -hmm. There there's an educational show called Doctor Kaboom. He he goes nuts with science. It's mm -hmm. great. Mm -hmm. And kids under five are free. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Do you get any? Because a lot of those new age people like to go to. Oh. This, you know? And yeah. they give their kids those kind of special <laughs> names. I, I sense a lead in here. Uh -huh. oh, Go ahead. Because I remember this from You remember this from yeah. Well, you fellows are experienced festival goers, and you've mm. had a chance to linger a while and go in the shops and get to know, for lack of a better term, us. Mm -hmm. And as you probably know, some of those, some of my colleagues have been hit a little hard with the druid stick. Yeah, with the new age rock. Oh, yeah. yeah. So, well, one day, uh, several years ago, at a Renaissance-themed event that was at the time closed, right? So mm. sun is going down on Renaissance land. The participants are out in the parking lot. They're trying to start their cars with crystals. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Chant again. I think I'm flooded. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Well, I drive a Taurus, but my carburetor's a Sagittarius. You can mm. imagine the color. Oh, oh, oh. I heard screamed across a Renaissance fest festival this. It was a mom on the edge, and she was yelling, Serenity! Serenity! You're really pissing me off! <laughs> <laughs> Serenity! Serenity. Well, yeah, right, right. Now, you can name your kid Serenity, but I tell you what, it's not going to stop you from having a two-year-old. <laughs> Now I heard a kid. I heard a kid with a great name, and it was at Scarborough. It's right in front of the pizza place, or not pizza, but in front of uh, the Pasta Palace. Uh -huh. I was standing there, and this little boy, about three years old, ran by me. And you know how little kids are—they run, 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 run. Yeah. His mother was in hot pursuit. She's running after him, and as she runs by me, she yells, "Chase! Chase! Ha! I'm back here, Chase!" <laughs> Oh, oh self-fulfilling uh, prophecy. Yeah, I yeah. wish yeah. I'd have been oh, there. Man. Well, I thought that was worth repeating, and indeed I did. Yes, I uh -huh. started telling other audiences this. Well, I'm telling another audience this, and all of a sudden, two little boys who happen to be right in the front row of one of my shows <coughs> pop up and look at each other and gasp. <gasps> and I thought, oh, that's a little strange. i got to find out what's going on here. Their name well, was Their Chase. name was Chase uh -huh. and Chance. Oh, oh. brothers, Chase and Chance. <laughs> Yeah. yeah. Next one was going to be named Oops. Oops. <laughs> and, but there's more. And the, wait, fourth there's one will more. Be, the fourth one will be named Rubber Broke. Yeah. 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 Or I was thinking if it's a girl, community chest. Oh. Um, and if it's obese, if it's fat chance. Fat yeah. chance. There, there you go. go. So then, <laughs> then, 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 I was do, doing a show up in Minnesota. Minnesota. Yeah, you bet. Yeah. And there's a, a, a little boy and girl, and they turned out to be brother and sister, and they're having a little tug of war. And they're yanking back and forth on something. All of a sudden, the brother gets it away from the sister. Sister stomps her foot and says, Justice! That is so not fair! <laughs> Justice? Oh, man. But wait, there's more! There's more! There's more. Now, guys, I'm gonna, and everyone listening, you got to think like me for a minute. Don't worry, the effects don't last long. <laughs> but, you know, start think, think on a spoonerism level here. you got to catch your swans and it's back and forth. All right. right. Don't start that again. All right. No, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll be good. But right. you, this is how you have to think to get this one. Okay. So out in Celebrity Universe now, almost three years ago, there was a birth, a blessed event, to Brad Pitt, uh, to Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt. No, uh -huh. that's Pitt. Last Pitt. name Pitt. Pitt. That's an important point. Pitt. <laughs> Do you know what they named their daughter? Peach. No, not Peach or <laughs> Apple what? or uh, uh, Arm or Olive. No, they named Shiloh. Shiloh oh, Pitt. Pitt. <laughs> Shiloh Pit. I never really thought yeah, there of it. You, you, yes, I, I got okay. it. I got it. I got it. What are these people thinking? They wake up in the morning saying, "Oh, never fear, our child will never go to middle school." Yeah, he'll never get guys, never get picked on, will he? No, when you when you're having children, 
I swear, you know ahead of time, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I yeah. mean, there are, there are warning signs that are very readable. <laughs> yeah. I know. I've had kids. Mm -hmm. We knew seven and a half, eight months ahead of time, something's coming down the chute here. Yeah. <laughs> or out the chute. Yeah, well, <laughs> so, so it means that you have enough time to get a little list together, mm -hmm. go out in your backyard, shout names across the neighborhood like you're calling them home for dinner. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, you could be out in a public place yelling at your kid, and if you think you'll never yell at your kid, ha! <laughs> <laughs> Try taking him to Disneyland. Yeah. Um, you'll be yelling at your kid and you'll be yelling things like, Charity, Charity, give that back. <laughs> Destiny, where are you going? And my absolute favorite, Chastity, do not put that in your mouth. No! <laughs> it's like the guy that had a wife. This is true. His wife was named Aranda. Not Rhonda, yeah, Aranda. Aranda. Because they asked, uh, swears it's a true story, came out of the delivery room and they were filling out, what do you want to name me? He says, uh, Rhonda. So her name was Aronda. Bo and Jim. Oh my God!